Now that we're back in the UK, this is the first washing machine we're going to be using upon arrival. It's my nanny's Samsung AdWash Eco Bubble 9kg 1400rpm digital inverter. We're doing a mixed load of some darks and whatever else in there. So keep yourselves tuned in, watch in HD because you are watching Florence Ballard A3060, the channel made in loving memory of the original Supreme Florence Ballard and Hoover's first 1100rpm automatic, the A3060 Electronic 1100. <laughs> cleaning rags and she's oh they'll be fine so just a mixed load of stuff I know I said I wasn't gonna wash my stuff in it but I just thought oh well throw it in for a, a laugh can always rewash it in another machine if it doesn't wash well but hopefully our load won't be as big as the first one we did from before we went to Australia that's really weird we used that, this machine was the last one we filmed in the UK, wasn't it? Yeah, it was the last machine we filmed in the UK, and the first one I filmed on upon coming back. Uh, that's really strange. <laughs> ah, someone obviously didn't check his pockets, it's got a little Care Bear key ring in there. Oh, bloody hell. I an SD card, Jesus Christ. Well, at least it's not the one I'm using my camera, that's a, a spare one. Um, now there were some tough stains on some of these shirts, like there. I think that's some curry oil or something. Well, I don't know. It's some grease or something, I think, from a burger. So we'll see how good that is. I'm washing it out. Uh, my nanny's kept. She's kept all um, the old detergents we gave her. But I'll show you something. Actually, you keep a sock out. I want to demonstrate the. Uh, a couple of socks out actually we can and some unmentionables. I wanna demonstrate the ad wash function. Because we didn't do that the first time with this. My nanny uses aerial pods and this is what the problem is with it. It's yeah God, that looks horrible. Oh you surf gems. How much have I got left? This is the ones that were used in the 9530 and the cassata. And the media did them at some point. Oh. Oh, all left from that. Got chirping birds. That was good for my. I think I threw up through the uh, cassata I did. Mm, I'm going to have to use these. These stupid things. I'm going to get everywhere in this machine because this machine doesn't use enough water. It's bloody hard doing it one handed. Ew. I feel like they're melting. It looked nice, but I don't think my nanny loads it properly though. She doesn't realise you've got to stick it back in the load. So I keep these out. I want to put it through here. See, no one's heard nanny and Brian have gone on a little holiday, a uh, weekend away. Oh damn! Have we got any bloody conditioner? Oh, we do actually. This was our one, Comfort Pure. That nearly ended in disaster. Oh, that smells so good to smell that again. The Australian detergents haven't got a pack. Oh, the conditioners. I think the scents are just too wild in some of them. Ah, oh, bloody spills it inside the. Ah, I don't know what. There you go. There you go. I cleaned it up before it went anywhere. Okay. Uh, 
And he always uses bloody daily wash 30 on this. This wireless machine's going to go to an early grave. Um, I'll use daily wash 60, I will. Yeah. Uh, Josh showed me how to put this machine in service mode, so I might do that afterwards. Just as long as I don't rip the lino by doing anything. Yeah, 1400 RPM. I'll do three rinses. Aaron 14, that's not too bad. I hate this because the only one I can see through is through there. And he never cleans this. Well, not up, but it's just annoying because I can't. You have part of that annoying drain that keeps gurgling every time. And we're filling. I didn't want to film this machine with anyone being here because you just know how everyone shouts in the background. You've got the birds chirping though. Rosie and Oh, I can't remember what the other one's called. Bob not Bobby. I think it is Bobby. What buddies? that you get the eco bubble generator going. Ah, there you go, that's what happens. It throws it onto the door sill no matter where you put it. Then that just gets left on there. I think the water sort of pushes it, if you put it at the bottom it pushes it forward. So as I was saying there has been a washing machine left at our old house but I'm not too sure what it is. Whatever it is, I'll just film it, just to keep things going. Be fun to mess around with, maybe, if it's something like this. Hopefully it's not. They said it's an old one. Well, that also means something different. Never know, though. That bloody annoys me, that does. This mach the only good thing about this machine, it doesn't seem to care at all about balancing. Unlike most Samsungs. We're going home in two days, so. Well, Monday morning. So. Let's be the only one of this machine here. These poor birds were put on top of the sink the other day. Um, I put up on Instagram, this machine was vibrating like crazy, it was doing a couple of mum's clothes. Birds were like, the budgies were scared, they, they literally were panicking. That oh, eco bubble generator. Just the pump come on. This only seemed to work when they were surf gems in there, to be honest. But now that is just going to say that, until something pushes it in. This is just the annoying thing because I can't. Let's have a look. So won't it? So how do you actually enable it? So what? So you do the air wash. I think you've got to press it and wait, isn't it? She's doing the distribution tumbles now. So I can't seem to open the ad wash, but I did open the machine just put two things in and shifted around the uh, pods. They didn't do spin washers, but the new, the new ways and the Zanussi jet systems did. Okay, eco bubble generator off. I hope it comes back on again. Doesn't really do anything to be honest. Ugh, I don't really like sitting on the floor. No choice. Why did my nanny have to go for the air wash? She's just gone for a normal Samsung. She could have gone for that Mila that I was going to get her. 
W4144 WPS from British Heart Foundation. So that's going to get her a Maloney service of us actually. It was a, uh, a Maloney service M3005W. It's uh, like a caress to the Easy Logic crossover model. 1500 RPM, it was actually 60 pound, that wasn't too bad. British R Foundation over in Wandsworth. I've got some studs there. Not even yet, it's stone cold in there. Let's up. Intermediate spin. Can't remember if it's. I think it's 800 RPM. That's what you're going to be hearing. Bear in mind, these machines switch the pump on and off as they ramp up. She's an anti-clockwise spinner as well. does distribute the other way. Let's see. Let's put the plug in maybe. That might yeah, it does look a little bit out of balance it does. about 400 RPM. They switch the pump on and off. I don't know if it's like the hot points where it only detects water. LGs do exactly the same thing. It's 400 RPM.
shaking up. Very quick burst they do. Burns again, stress there because they're feeling the vibration. First rinse, uh, low level, from what I remember. Show you one thing in it. This chest freezer here, Nova Scotia, that has been going probably since the 80s. That's still going to this day. This is well before I was born, that chest freezer, and that's still going. That's lasted about probably, I'd say it lasted probably as long as my Hotpoint 9530. Cook has been replaced once. No, twice. Nanny had an old Old Zanussi, an 80s like brown one, and then she had a like early 2000 one, now she got a belling. One second to me to spin now. So I'll put the bloody plug in so it doesn't actually come through. And you might be able to see. It just passes the U bend, but it doesn't come through the sink. No, second intermediate spin, guys. And then flash as well. You can see a bit better in there. Oh, immediate anti clockwise tumble. Part of me thinks this machine didn't even reach 60. I'm sure we have to enable the intensity, but I don't know how we do it. But see, it just doesn't care. Quick burst of 400 RPM.
go. too unbalanced. balanced.
machine. So as you'll see, on here the machine just keeps filling in little pulses. Don't know why. It would make more sense for just to do one continuous fill. One little throw at a time. No, I opened it. Oh, gosh. Once you put some service mode with the door allowed to open, we'll do that in another video because I'll be coming back. Then 1400 RPM. I think this is just burst, yeah, just go, just, just go straight. To, well, goes to 800 first.
station. machine really Fourteen hundred spin does kind of good. Just needs a little bit, little more acceleration to it. Be ready for it. Little ending tune we get from this machine. That reminds me of my old WM eight sixty four. It used to do that at the end of the cycle. You had the flashing red key. It was a keyhole, and it would go beep, beep, beep at the end. <coughs> That's near my MacBook, and then you went off the table. I think now you could, but you still can't open that. It's funny, unless you've got to wait for it to unlock, maybe, or something like that. Is off. Okay, so that's that, guys. So, watching Josh's video, we're going to put on the test mode and get it fill up. Not much, just a little bit. Just have to wet the load. And then we put it to spin. I don't want to soak the load like what I did at British Art Foundation. <laughs> I can't believe it BHF and that was just a, load, a little load of towels that did that. Get out of the way. Stuff might happen. I'm just gonna let the machine do what it needs to do, but I'm also gonna try and get it real unbalanced. 
We'll see if this can be 2019's most unbalanced load. It wasn't going to wait there. No. Let's read that sound. That's probably the motor doing that. It's not wanting to get unbalanced, is she? I just thought that the wetting the load would help. I want a BHF to see it first time. That was like jump first time. It is unbalanced, but not not as unbalanced as I please. It may take a few times. This is the fun, the only fun thing with having a Samsung. Being able to do this. Oh yeah. Darks and towels and whatnot done in the Samsung Ad Wash Eco Bubble. Um, that will be next. Maybe the machine we got at home, we'll see what that is. So, thank you very much for watching, guys, and don't forget to keep it supreme and go with the flow.